is a rent in two, with many of my subjects plunged into the darkness of night. The arrival of the noble Torino may be our last chance to restore the glorious sunlight to all our world. When I banished the starry queen from my kingdom, I expected her to learn some humility and return to me as a worthy consort. That woman's pride knows no bounds, and her treachery threatens to destroy my kingdom. She has enslaved my people in the valley of the night, who now know only her dark rule of superstition and terror. I now accept that I cannot reconcile with you. And I intend to make the Prince Tomino my heir. When he marries the Princess Tomino and ascends my throne, then, then my king will be reunited and told my people can live again in the glorious sunlight of truth and wisdom. No, the law. Is this young prince really worthy of such an honor? Is he brave and truthful? Does he show shines of growing in wisdom? The young prince is brave and truthful. He will be given great trials. And with the love of Pamina and the graces bestowed by the magic flute, he will prevail. He will grow in wisdom and honor. But that foolish and cowardly man, the one who thinks he's a bird, he should never have been allowed into the temple. Such a man could never to understand our sins. In this you are wrong. Fetch me the Prince Tomino and his unwilling companion, so that I may bestow on them a blessing before the gods of this temple. <coughs> Although we live in total devotion to these mysteries, it does not mean that all men might not learn from us. But the game 